Well, on the ice now, the second American pair in the final grouping and in second place with uh, a wide open door, 31-year-old Kala Urbanski and her 25-year-old partner, Rocky Marvel. They've been skating together for about a year and a half. And if ever a word feisty applied to a skater, it's to Kala Urbanski. This program is set up to really let them do their technical stuff. Their opening move is a triple twist. Watch how high she gets up over his head. Nicely done. Here comes a throw triple loop. Now this is the biggest throw triple loop I think I've ever seen. Look how far away she ends up from him. Oh, beautifully landed. Unbelievable. This can be a trouble jump for her. Side by side double axles. And she falls. Oh. Will that fall hurt, Scott? It's hard to tell. You know, compared with Kajiki and Sands falling the triple twist, it's just not going to hurt them at all. They've got to keep clean, though, after this. They have to keep clean. This is the opportunity that they've been waiting for, and they got to take advantage of it. Because that wasn't the first difficult move in their program, they've got the confidence knowing that they landed that throw triple loop. She's not giving up easily. Well, we talked about the disparity in ages between Kachiki and Sand. Natasha Kachiki at 14 here is Kala Urbanski at 31 years of age. Her fifth pair is partner. And she says, I love skating with Rocky Marble because he wants success as badly as I do. And what an accomplishment this would be for them. Uh, Kala's been around a long time. In my very first summer skating school in 1968, Kala Urbanski was there. <laughs> She's worked awfully hard. This is a great lift right here. A very unique entrance into the lift right there. And a great dismount. Rocky Marvel, Kala's partner, 25 years of age, from Wilmington, Delaware, was a single skater. Rocky Marvel may seem to be... Huge throw double axle. A perfectly appropriate name after that demonstration of strength, but his real name is Rocco Marvaldi. The pride of Trenton, New Jersey. Flips into double toe loop. A little step out on her part. You think they've got first place secured, though? I would think so. This program isn't as strong artistically as Kuchiki and Sands, but they really hit some incredibly hard elements. They did them so well that it'd be. I think they. I think they've won it. Tracy. Oh, definitely. I think they've won. They've had incredible speed. They've been so enjoyable to watch. Just the confidence that they've exuded. And she's a fighter. Judges like that. Well, a couple of blue 
blue-collar kids from a sport not known for its blue-collar background. Gala Urbanski has worked as a bartender and a waitress to support herself. Rocky Marble's mom and dad are running his trucking company while they prepare for what they hope will be a spot in the Olympic Games in Albertville. Here's another look at their triple twist they open the program with. Look how high she gets. She goes around once, twice, three times. Perfectly landed. Nicely done. Great. Urbanski and Marvel now wait for their marks with their coaches, Ron Ruddington and Peter Burroughs. And these are great marks. 5.6, five fives, five, five, a couple, one, two five fours. Again, strong skating, great technical skating, a great performance. That's all right. All right, you know. And these might go down just a little bit because of the fact that they've really focused in on the technical portion of the program. The artistic has to suffer a little bit, but still great marks. One, five, six, uh, three, five, fours. That'll definitely put them into first place. Where, where is that? Uh, where Meanwhile, is that? backstage, Christy Yamaguchi at the skate. Waiting can be the most difficult part for an athlete. We'll be back right after this message and a word from your local station.